you know, they might get treated for depression, but actually they just have a dietary issue. If they would cut the fruit sugar, the depression would be gone. So there is this really prevalent digestive disease that a lot of people have and probably don't know about. Maybe you have it too. It's called fructose malabsorption. Let me tell you about it. Hey everyone, Manuel here from Ticket to Fitness. Fructose malabsorption means that the fructose, which is fruit sugar that you eat, is not digested properly in your intestines. Okay, so it's also a normal sugar which splits into fructose and glucose in your body, but it's also in lots of foods on its own, for example, in lots of soft drinks, soda, and to the likes. And the problem with fruit sugar is that a lot of people, actually about 30% in some studies, don't digest this properly and the fructose gets even deeper into your intestines and is not digested properly. Now this opens a can of worms because this changes the bacterial flora of your guts. And this changes a lot of other stuff in your body. Lots of people have bloated bellies, lots of people have digestive issues, they have to throw up or they feel sick after eating fruit sugar like this, you have to burp a lot, you have diarrhea. Now this also opens a can of worms in a lot of other areas. You have decreased zinc, you have decreased serotonin, you have decreased folic acid. And if that doesn't mean anything to you, it means that you get depressed from a digestive issue. You get depressed. You get really angsty or angry. It can change the way you act because serotonin is a very important neurotransmitter in your brain. So a lot of people might suffer from depression because they eat fruit sugar and don't know anything about this. You know, they might get treated for depression, but actually they just have a dietary issue. If they would cut the fruit sugar, the depression would be gone. Isn't that mad? And the funny thing is, fructose malabsorption is a lot more common than exotic diseases like celiacy or lactose intolerance, okay? There are much more people who can't eat and digest fructose than there are people who can't digest lactose. So please subscribe to my YouTube channel and if you know people who suffer from digestive issues, share this with them. And feel free to write something in the comment, ask questions if you want. I leave further details about this thing in the description so you can read more about it. And if you want to find out if you suffer from it, go to your doctor, do a breathing test. It's really cheap. It doesn't take a lot of time, maybe two to three hours. You have to drink fructose and then breathe into a little tube and do it again after half an hour and do it again after half an hour and then if you breathe methane they know you have it or you don't. If you have it, it means you shouldn't eat fruit sugar and it means a lot of your mental problems come from eating fruit sugar. <laughs> I hope this opened the eye for some of you and uh, I hope you enjoyed this video about nutrition. It's my first one so please leave a thumbs up if you like this, if you learned something new. And see you next time. Goodbye.